This is Witchbase News for Friday the 7th of February 2020. I'm Commander Burr. In this weeks news Frontier speaks on fleet carriers the latest on low temperature diamond prices the Thargoids are throwing everything at us Paige Harvey is leaving Frontier we found a new podcast to listen to and ED Tutorials is now on Facebook. If you enjoy this video consider subscribing and also click the little bell icon to make sure you don't miss any of our future videos. This week there was a surprise fleet carrier themed nugget dropped in the weekly Let's Play livestream that Frontier hosts on Monday afternoons UTC. When faced with questions on livestreams about fleet carriers or when we'll hear more about fleet carriers the team at Frontier always give a fairly standard non-committal ...we're not ready to announce anything yet or something similar. But this week when Will Flanagan was inevitably hit with the question again he responded with a slightly less non-committal answer. He said and I quote ...we'll have more details about that probably around after the 24 hour livestream unquote. The livestream Will is referring to is the 24 hour charity livestream in aid of the special effect charity which starts on the 21st of February. Paige Harvey who was also on the livestream with Will then further stated that we'll likely hear something sometime after the end of February. It's worth saying here that Will then went on to say that he didn't think this information was a big announcement or reveal. Personally I'd like to argue that point quite vigorously. There's been quite a tortured history of the fleet carrier system from its original reveal at the end of 2017. Suffice to say it's been promised then delayed then promised then delayed and we still know almost nothing about it whatsoever. In fairly typical and dare I say it somewhat frustrating Frontier fashion we didn't know when we'd know more about it. Carriers have been on the board now for 2 years and at this point the sense of anticipation with its associated undercurrent of frustration from the community is palpable to put it mildly and anything anything at all on carriers is huge news. Reading between the lines and we could be wrong here but what it sounds like is we'll hear more on carriers sometime in March. There's a link in the description to the relevant clip of the livestream where the team speak about carriers. What's your feeling on this? Let us know in the comments. A quick update on the low temperature diamond prices and demand issues that we touched on last week. Frontier updated again this week to say that they'd identified a problem where diamonds were in demand at the wrong economy system types. The diamonds should only be consumed by tourism, high tech, industry and refinery type systems. At the time of this recording that fix should be in place in the game. As for low temperature diamond prices the Burr Pit Mining Company was out last night as it is most nights and they were recording prices in the region of 1.5 million per unit still. Right now it appears that there is still huge currency to be made from mining and selling low temperature diamonds. It's worth noting as well that the guys didn't have to hunt high and low to get these prices. When the Thargoids resumed their attacks in the Pleiades and the Witchhead sector a few weeks back the assumption was that the cyclical nature of the attacks that we'd seen up until they went on a 5 month hiatus would continue. It appears that in part at least that is very much not the case. The anti xeno community in the game has gotten very good and I do mean very good at clearing out the infected systems as soon as they descend into a state of incursion. Systems infected with heavy Thargoid presence were being cleared out in a matter of hours meaning that the weekly freshly Thargoided systems only presented non-human combat zones for the first couple of days before being thoroughly cleansed. Likewise the resultant fires in space stations in systems under incursion were extinguished when the Thargoid threat was driven out. It seems that this has not gone unnoticed by Frontier however and clearing out the Thargoid presence has become significantly more challenging. As of this recording the systems that were in a state of incursion last week which you can find in our weekly Thargoid report which is linked on screen now are still in a state of incursion this week despite them being hit 
with wave after wave after wave of anti xeno ships from the community for an entire week. As a result the stations that were ablaze last week are still burning just as bright this week. How long it's going to take to clear an attack now is unknown but it does mean that if you're an anti xeno pilot with no free time at the weekend you now have all week in order to practice and refine your art. Likewise if you've not tried out the station rescue missions before then there's never been a better time. Community manager and co pilot stalwart Paige Harvey announced this week that she will be departing Frontier Towers for Pastures New at the end of February. Everyone at the Burr Pit wishes you calm seas and fair winds for your onward journey Paige. We're a bit late to this party but if you're in the market for a good elite dangerous podcast that is well informed, well presented and full of lively and friendly discussion then we recently discovered the Loose Screws podcast. Streaming from just about every platform imaginable you'll find links in the description to the show itself as well as their Discord community. And finally we're very pleased and honoured to announce that we've recently been invited to join the edtutorials.com initiative that we reported on a couple of weeks back. If you're unfamiliar with ED Tutorials it's a website helmed by Commander Exegius with the help of the AXI and members of his own community at level 11 that is aiming to be the most complete single resource for learning everything about Elite Dangerous. Whilst it's a must have for your Elite Dangerous bookmarks list it's now also become a Facebook page. Links to both the website and the Facebook page are below. For more details on anything we've talked about in the show this week then check out the video description below. If you've enjoyed this video consider subscribing to the channel and be sure to click the little bell icon to make sure you don't miss any of our future videos. And if you want to help support the work of this channel you'll also find links below to Patreon. That's it for now. Thanks very much for watching. We'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then ….o7 CMDRs follow the greens on the way out and do keep clear of the toast rack. We very much look forward to seeing you next time. 